Take you along. So normally we would be taking my trailer, which is normally sitting right there, uh, but it was stolen. Discovered that last night as I was driving up here to get everything ready for the day and pulled up and realized my trailer's gone. So whoever has it out there, sorry, but it was empty. <laughs> well, it wasn't empty. There was plastic bags, five tables, and the three boxes of latex gloves that we needed today so that we could properly serve. So, shame on you. But we're gonna make it work anyways. Devil ain't gonna stop us. promotional but also we've got stuff in there that we need uh, but yeah loading up the truck the old church truck yeah baby Here we are out at our food pantry, man. We got an awesome response from volunteers today, and uh, looking forward to serving uh, our community. We've already got a hundred cars lined up as well, and so looking forward to being a blessing to them today uh, in the midst of kind of crisis, if you will. And uh, looking forward to just being a blessing. I don't know how many times I can say blessing, but I'm gonna. So thankful that we had those volunteers. Uh, it wouldn't have happened without them. Love the dogs, don't we? All right, dogs are done. Uh, yeah, so we had extra volunteers from Shawnee. We had extra volunteers from the Shawnee Mission School District. We had a couple from Harvesters. Uh, and man, what a great day. Uh, what a great way to bless people in the middle of a crisis, in the middle of the mess that we're in. And uh, 
I hope that everybody that helped today was uh, as blessed as I was just getting to see faces and make them smile and have a good time. And uh, yeah, so many people were so thankful for what they had. One lady said, I have to have this every week or every month to make it. And that just kind of breaks your heart. Um, but thankful that we were able to bless them in that today. So yeah, it's a good day. Good day. <laughs>